English is not my native language, so I hope you will understand me. Uh, and uh, first, I think it uh, will be um, nice if I explain what is Ukraine for Nauka, because uh, we are not a publisher. We, might, uh, we are more like intermediate organization between our publishers in Ukraine and Crossref. Uh, why it is so, I will explain a little later. <laughs> okay. Uh, the main objective to create Ukraine for Nauka in 2009 uh, was, uh, um, was aimed to create unified uh, space for uh, all scientists uh, to uh, simplify ordering and uh, to make a catalog of uh, scientific periodicals uh, to make uh, easier for people to, uh, to order academic journals uh, and uh, other articles. So uh, we made our site on which we have a unified catalog. Here are books, monographs, uh, scientific journals and in uh, 2014, uh, we began to offer uh, services um, of assigning DOIs. Uh, so we have uh, a section on our site where we uh, try to help our publishers to understand how to create a website, uh, what they need to do, how to uh, deposit DOI, how to deposit it uh, for, uh, for an article, for a book, for a monograph, and other works. Uh, so, uh, we began in 2014 as um, cooperation with one organization. We had only one prefix, and we uh, cooperated only with uh, 10 journals, and we was a uh, cross-ref member. Yeah, now, in uh, 2009, uh, we have uh, 21 organizations we work with, we have 22 prefixes, we have 162 journals, and we are Crossref sponsoring member. I know that uh, for somebody it is uh, not a huge amount, but uh, for us, uh, in five years, it's uh, really great work. And after the launch of the program, the initiative for open citations in 2017, uh, we opened uh, references for all our partners. Um, we are asking our partners to um, upload references for all uh, work they are depositing. And uh, the joining to Crossref stimulated uh, the creation of new sites because uh, most of the journals didn't have even a site. They were uh, they was only printed, and uh, they was uh, only in Ukrainian. So uh, many people understand now that they uh, should have a nice site they should have a translation to English. Uh, they uh, should use a reference list formatting as, uh, as it is in worldwide. And uh, of course, uh, that leads uh, our journals to, um, to value more uh, reviewing, plagiarism checking, uh, to make our articles uh, more high level. So we demand uh, we demand uh, after DOE signing. We demand uh, also reference uh, depositing, and uh, now uh, we want to send Crossref for new metadata manager. We already tried to use it, and uh, our partners already start to using it. Uh, this uh, application is really great. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, and uh, as for help we provide for our partners, it's uh, methodological literature. Uh, we publish little books, like this one in my hand, uh, where we try to uh, keep all information, publish a need for creating site, for assigning DOI, for using applications uh, like uh, web deposit form and uh, metadata manager. 
Uh, also, we uh, hold seminars and conferences once per year. It's a great conference in Ukraine, which is uh, organized by National Academy of Sciences of Ukraine. Uh, after this conference, we uh, publish a bigger book. Uh, where all information that was there is uh, printed to uh, make uh, other people who are interested, but uh, they uh, could not uh, to go to us, <laughs> they can read it. Uh, also, we provide technical support. Uh, we try to keep in touch with all our partners to help them if they have some errors during depositing, if they have some questions uh, that could be in person or uh, via phone, via email. Uh, we try to help our people <laughs> as we can. Uh, also about uh, Berlin, uh, it's a um, hard question for uh, Ukrainian journals because uh, some time ago our government, uh, they uh, made a law um, that governmental organization can't pay in uh, other countries' uh, currency, only in Krivnos. So we like intermediary between our publishers and Crossref with uh, these billion questions. Uh, and I think this is it. Thanks for your attention. I'll be happy to, ask, uh, to answer your questions.